to just to think that the chief law enforcement officer in Allegheny County is going to single out an individual lawyer and then punish everybody that he represents. It's, it's unheard of. Allegheny County District Attorney Stephen Zapala in the hot seat tonight after allegations surfaced claiming his office is no longer offering plea deals to clients of attorney Milton Rayford. It comes after Rayford reportedly called out systemic racism in the local criminal justice system. Chris Hoffman is live tonight with more, including how one judge is now fighting back. Chris. Judge David Cashman says he would not be allowing any plea agreements inside his courtroom. He says everyone should be treated equally, and he alerted the district attorney's office to his new policy this morning. Somebody's case should be decided upon its merits, not upon the selection of what counsel represents the defendant. According to a Tribune Review report, defense attorney Milton Rayford called out what he sees as systemic racism in criminal justice back in May. A few days later, Allegheny County DA Stephen Sapala allegedly emailed his staff saying to no longer offer plea agreements to Rayford's clients. I wish I could say that I'm surprised, but I'm not. Teron Jenkins is a criminal defense attorney and ran for DA in 2019. He and other attorneys are now uniting behind Rayford. These problems didn't just start with this interaction with Milton Rayford. These problems have been permeating for years. In a statement, Rayford says, quote, I will always speak out on injustice. My prayer for Mr. Sapala is that he repent for possessing mindset that he has and finds the peace that I found. This is a real disadvantage to every potential client of this attorney because virtually all criminal cases are resolved through plea bargains. David Harris, a law professor at Pitt, says elected officials need to take criticism. And he says while this matter is not illegal, it is unethical. What they can't do is manipulate the terms with which they deal with the actual cases of real people just because they don't like the opinions of the lawyer. Meanwhile, Jenkins says this has damaged the credibility of the DA's office. And Judge Cashman says he'll allow plea bargains again only when the DA's office gives them to everyone. He represents us. He has to come and he has to speak with us. That's the only way these, these things are going to change. By treating him differently, you've treated his client differently, and you violated your oath to treat all of these people fairly and impartially. Now, the DA has refused to comment on these allegations against his office. The ACLU has asked the state attorney general to intervene, and local elected leaders, including state representatives Summer Lee and Emily Kincaid, have asked the district attorney to step down. Live outside the Allegheny County Courthouse this evening, Chris Hoffman, KDKA News.